Good morning, Open Door. Caleb Lynch here with you, lead pastor. Hey, I want to wish you a happy New Year's. And uh, man, we're just excited for what God has done this year and what he's going to continue to do next year. Uh, but I did want to share with you a couple of things that are coming up. So the first one is that in about a week, starting on the 8th and 9th, um, we have our women's Bible study starting back up. So if you've been wanting to be a part of one of our women's studies, um, you got to go online and get registered for it. So even if you did last semester, you still need to go online, get registered and get signed up for this new one that's coming up here in about a week. Okay, next thing that's happening that you, it's just, man, this is going to be so cool. Our middle schoolers are getting to go to a youth conference here in town. They're getting to stay uh, out in the east part of Phoenix. Um, they're all staying together at a location, and then they're going to spend, spend a day or so at this youth conference. And I got to take a look at who's going to be teaching at it and whatever else. It's going to be an awesome time for our middle schoolers. So middle schoolers, if you still haven't gotten signed up for this, this is going to be at the end of the month, so January 26th through the 28th. So make sure you get signed up for that. Man, I want all of our middle schoolers going. I think it'll be just a great time of learning and being together and having, having a great time. So that's coming up, make sure to get registered. All right, it's, it's the new year, so that means our adult classes are starting back up also. So um, the journey and the legacy, those two classes. The journey, uh, we've been talking a lot about it, but they're gonna be going through that meaning of marriage. Um, so if that's something you're still wanting to be a part of, you gotta make sure to get registered for that. They need to know how many people are gonna be there. Um, and then for the legacy, they're gonna go through a book study. They're gonna go through one of John Mark Comer's books called Live No Lies. Um, and so you'll wanna be a part of that too if you're interested in that. Uh, we're, we're just excited for what God's doing in those adult classes this year. And the last thing I just wanna share with you, um, you guys, this has been an amazing year. Uh, we got to celebrate our 50 years and it was a beautiful celebration. Got to see old faces and a bunch of new faces and and um, man, it's just been an amazing, amazing year. And um, I, I just want to pause to thank everyone. Um, thank you all for your generosity. Um, man, it, it, was, it was amazing what came in this year. I, I think of a couple of specific things. There was a ton of things that happened, but one of the big ones was um, our church donated $24,000 to see kids go to camp this summer. Uh, that floored us when those dollars were coming in, and that was a huge deal. We were able to cut the cost of camp and make it affordable in, in some transitionary times. Another thing that was really sweet was there was this need that happened in Bosnia. There was this big youth conference, and we had just simply asked, hey, could we help maybe send a couple of kids to this youth conference? And, and, uh, and $8,000, over $8,000 came forward to help support uh, Bosnian youth participate in this really neat Christian conference. So that was amazing. And then on top of all of that, as a church, um, we gave over $650,000 this year. And um, it just floors me when I think about uh, the reality that all of us together uh, and the generosity that has come from everyone. So thank you, thank you. We could not do ministry without it. And we're just excited for what's next and, and what God's gonna do. So love you all. Thanks for an amazing year. Uh, there's so much more I wish I could celebrate with you, but this is an announcement video, so we gotta get to church. Uh, love you guys. We'll see you soon. Talk to you later. Bye.